Kia ora, Chrissy back again, and we're going to get into the next episode of Season 4 of Stranger Things. So last time we left off with Fred being um, brutally murdered, uh, just like Chrissy had been. Uh, our Dustin and Steve and co, they found uh, Eddie and he's explained to them what's happened and they're explaining to him what they know about all the weird goings on in Hawkins. We also had Al being again bullied by Angela uh, but this time it was like pretty bad and it was caught on film and it got to her so bad that Al smacked her in the face with a, with a roller skate. My God. Uh, and the tension between uh, Will and Mike kind of coming to a bit of a head um, with Will telling Mike that, you know, that Al's been lying to him about what's been going on and being pissed off that, you know, Mike didn't take the steps necessary to keep his friendship with Will um, as alive as what he has done with Al, though Mike, you know, also turns that back on him. We also have Joyce teamed up with Murray and uh, they are trying to figure out how to rescue uh, Hopper. They're getting together this 40 grand and I, I, I guess they're going to take it to Alaska. I think the guy said no Alaska. So that's going on. And yeah, I think that's pretty much the main things that are going on at the moment. So we're going to get into the next episode, uh, season four, episode three, the monster and the superhero. Let's do it. Nevada. Why are we here? A helicopter? Sam. Oh, it's Paul Riser. I was wondering when he was going to come in. Okay, Doc is back. There oh. are no signs of any attack. Does this remind you of anything, Doctor? Why is oh my God! I am so fucking dumb. Men like you who created this problem in the first place. Everything that has happened. Oh. Wow, this is going way back. That all that body breaking. That's what happened. Oh, with Al in the back, back in the fucking back times. <laughs> we can do this a hard way. He did help. Um. The hard way it is. Why are you taking that box? I'm talking to you! Sam, do something. Yeah, I cannot believe I didn't fucking put the two and two together that, you know, all that, that bone breaking is exactly like when we first were introduced to Al at the very beginning of the first episode. Sometimes I wonder how I get out of bed in the morning. <gasps> Al, you're in trouble. Oh shit, it's the ambulance. You're in trouble, girl. Salt and battery. Do you know where you are, Angela? Um, Rink Rinkomania? Oh, look at them looking at her. <laughs> I mean, it was just like rubber wheels. Plastic. Oh. Not like hard plastic, just... The soft kind. Like so people don't get hurt when they get smacked. Mm. Yeah, because it happens more than you Dude, do. you're fucking well both of you. Drugged up. Just a little blip. That's a funny word, man. Blip. 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 Oh my god. Mom? Yeah, did they just leave without telling the kids? Well, well. Oh, I thought she left you already. Sore eyes, huh? Hi, Murray. The kids like risotto? Yeah. I do like risotto. That business trip. Business trip? What business trip? This thing came Can up. Can you pass me the olive oil? Minute, That's wine. <laughs> in Alaska. Alaska? So do Eskimos like still live in igloos? Or, uh. Who is this? 
So. <laughs> what? What's going on? Your mom's calling Alaska. He is high as fuck. <laughs> this girl got smacked in the head today at the roller rink. Smacked. Yeah, it was one of those vicious skate attacks. Skate attack. <laughs> Mike's angry. Ow. This was Odo. He's smacking, dude. <laughs> Still have no idea who he is. <laughs> oh, oh, he is such a welcome addition. I love Mari. Oh, she does remember it, or she just gets flashes. I don't know. Those little creatures are cool. They're like bats, creepy bats, and creepy tendrils. With spikes. Oh, they're gonna plug in. Up the Jaxi. Oh, he's gonna attack now. Creepy. What are you guys doing? We're gearing up. Preparing for the hunt. Oh my god. And we're not killers like Eddie. And we just want to talk to him. Little friendly neighborhood chat. If you're not up to this, you can go home. There's no judgment. Go home. No. Pressure. I'm good. Delivery service. They're uh, pretty convinced you killed Chrissy. Like 100%. You need to find Vecna, kill him, and prove your innocence. That's all, Dustin. That's all. No, that's pretty much it. He's pretty experienced in this kind of stuff. Tarp. 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 Oh, this is for Fred? Oh, gruesome. It was by the picnic table, is that correct? Miss Weaver. Oh. Ring a bell? Uh oh. Someone's gonna be there in her time of need when Jonathan can't be. Oh, go check on your girl, Mike. Why didn't you tell me what's going on here? I've been bullied my entire life. I mean, I, I know what it's like. I am different. Okay. I do not belong. You can't actually believe that. You don't love me anymore. Oh. Who said that I didn't? You never say it. I say it. Oh, it's a, <laughs> the other half of me also is like, well, you're, you're still kids, you know. You, I don't want to be one of those people that are like, you're a kid. You don't know what love is. You may or may not be aware of an incident that happened last night involving Jane at the Wrinkle Mania. That was an accident. We have a warrant here that says otherwise. A warrant? Come on, come on, that's crazy. That doesn't need to happen. Hey there. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, God, I couldn't think of anything worse than being stuck next to a smoker on a freaking flight. Don't discuss it. Rude. This is on purpose, isn't it? Your Russian is getting better. So is your acting. I heard from your friends. If my pilot gets the money, you can hitch a ride with him back to your country. This is not gonna go well. Fred and Chrissy don't make sense. I mean, why them? They clearly had something in their histories. Secrets. Fred started acting weird the second we got here. Max said Chrissy was upset too. Yeah, but not here. If you saw a monster, you, you wouldn't go to the police. They'd never believe you. But you might go to your, your shrink. Gonna oh, get um, Mexico going. Us ladies will stick together. Unless you think we need you to protect us. Always the goddamn babysitter. He wants to be the superhero. Still? Okay. 
Oh boy. Hello, early fellas. Yeah, Iron Maiden. We're looking for Eddie Munson. He's not here. Hey, man. Fucking hell. Destin Henderson. What? Destin Henderson. Where do we find this? Dustin. I'm going to need you to give me a verbal response. Where's your lawyer? Some minor. So wrong. Did you want to kill her? Oh my god, are you serious? Right to the right. It looks like she's still being processed. Hey, look. Is there any chance we can just see her? Do you have to be a parent or legal guardian? You have no. to be kidding. That is ridiculous. That's the law. And you're not Where's her fucking lawyer? Was she given a lawyer? Was she asked? Did they do that back then? I don't know. Yeah. Hmm? Wanna break his... Okay. He needs to get off the chain gang, so... Injure himself? Get himself injured? Oh my god, the things he's going through. Do you have a minute to talk? Um, yeah, of course. Of course. Inappropriate. I get why though, but... So... We're gonna talk about it? Sorry, what? Talk about what? Earlier today when you basically threw yourself at Nan. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. I'll punch you so hard in your face that your teeth will fall back out. Oh. <laughs> Too far. Not cool. Sorry. Yeah, cool. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. These two are hilarious. You've experienced trauma, Max. And when you keep your feelings... Oh no! But everything that went on with Billy, will she be targeted as well? Cops asked me a bunch of questions. Did they talk to you? Oh, she'd rather do that than... Max, I'm I'm sorry, I, I really can't discuss this. Can I use the bathroom? Anything to avoid talking about Billy. Just drive. Nothing. Steve, drive! To the office. Check the files. Are you guys looking for Eddie? Found him, no thanks to you. You found him? He's at a boathouse on Coal Mill Road. Dude! Bad shit's about to go down. What are you talking about? What bad shit? Oh, fuck! Lucas? I was I was looking for clues. Clues? What, well, freshman think he's Sherlock Holmes or something? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's something to high-five about. High-five? <laughs> fuck, what a nerd. I found one. A clue. I know where Eddie's hiding. Well, it's not quite a clue. That's like the answer. <laughs> oh boy. Oh god, now who's this? Oh god, of course. Hey, kiddo. Now, is this a good thing or a bad thing? Okay, I'm confused about what the purpose of him... So he was going for the chains. Oh, fuck. I missed so much shit. It's making sure that it was, um... Oh, no, it was going for his foot. So he could get the chain off. <clears throat> oh, nah, gross. <laughs> F 
fucking hell, Hopper. The physical torment that this man has been going through. The Weekly Watcher, I can't believe they have this. Don't they write about, like, Bigfoot and UFOs? First of all, UFOs are absolutely real. If someone's gonna write about that, it's gonna be these weirdos. This is true. Victor Creel claims vengeful demon killed family. The murder that shocked a small community. <laughs> Victor believed his house was haunted by an ancient demon. Victor allegedly hired that is um the house that we see in the upside down what if a demon did invade Victor's home this demon wasn't any old demon it was Vecna okay so it's been around for a while you found it yeah and not just Chrissy's file Fred was seeing Miss Kelly too flanked his ass from both sides that freak won't know what hit him did he actually tell them where he is Hawkins is in danger. Oh, they're gonna take her back. You're sure Eddie was here? Yeah, I'm, I'm positive. Okay, this isn't. But they He's off. I know it's not fair to ask more of you. But her powers are gone. What if I told you there was a way? a way to bring them back but bring them back stronger than before i'm gonna ask that you leave with me now oh fuck nightmares headaches difficulty sleeping can i see fred's file yeah. nice. she's the same it's a lot for anyone <laughs> oh no they're gone. Fuck. It, oh. Here's the clock sound. Max is next. Oh no. Oh fuck. She can't die, she's one of the main characters. Don't do this. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> That was good <laughs> um not looking forward to the uh to this thing freaking haunting max so it looks like it's been going on for a while it just hasn't you know come full set up uh, you know just have, hasn't happened fully to her yet uh i thought he was going to be going after the jock guy but um not yet i guess but they can't they can't kill max off she is one of the main characters. So L has gone with um, the doctor. What does he mean by being able to give her her powers back? I honestly thought that her powers would be something that is like kind of she's like put away for the time being. You know, you know that whole existential crisis can't can't um reach them can't use them um, until she's like honest with herself yeah i thought it was going to be one of those kind of uh storylines but he's going to be able to give her powers back to her um okay also the memory that she's having of you know that one time where she went you know bananas and the um with all the other uh children is that something that she's co conscious of remembering that she did that and will that leave her vulnerable to becoming a victim of Vecna as well? Because all of these people, well, the, um, yeah, Chrissy and Fred, clearly they had some kind of thread that connects them, that, that some, not connects them per se, but like something that they have that's similar. Of, uh, and 
like a death or something that that they feel that they were responsible for or that they perhaps were responsible for in a certain way i don't know maybe i'm thinking too much into it and obviously we know that l has had many deaths responsible but she's responsible for many deaths i don't know but for her to leave just up and leave you know jonathan i'm guessing the 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 um the, the agents that showed up at uh, the bias house have got had gone to tell them that you know that al has gone with with the doctor or she's not coming back that's not going to sit well especially not with mike and he's going to do something but yeah really good episode uh uh lucas clearly he's um taking his jock friends somewhere different that you know but now it looks like he's ditched them uh hopefully to get lost out in the woods for a while at least where he's going i'm guessing he's going to come back to i don't know is he going to come and join our guys or is he going to stay with them um hopefully he's coming back to join with our guys so i don't like them being on the outs with each other <laughs> you know they they work well as a team they need to come back as a team but yeah this was a good episode uh, and i can't wait to see what's going to happen next so we're going to leave it there for today thank you for joining with me don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we'll see you next time for more stranger things see ya